Welcome to Cold Cap Club. This video is all about visiting a hairdresser during scalp cooling treatment. I'm often asked by people who are having cold cap treatment, uh, can I visit a hairdresser? And I understand that maybe if your hair's thinning or you're really trying to do your best to look after your hair, that visiting a hairdresser may be something that you're not sure about. So in this next video, what I'm going to do is talk to Claire Paxman from Paxman Scalp Coolers and share together our tips about it is okay to visit a hairdresser during your treatment. So if you want to trim maybe, or a gentle treatment, that should be fine. But we'll really go through some of the do's and don'ts so that you can feel much more empowered and confident actually at taking care and maintaining your hair during your scalp cooling treatment. When it comes to going to a hairdresser during scalp cooling treatment, a lot of people get in contact with us and say, oh, I'm a bit worried about going to my hairdresser. Can I have my yeah. hair cut or coloured? And what we say is it's OK to have your hair trimmed. Just please ask your hairdresser to be really, really gentle. So no big blow dries, yeah, yeah. no getting out the heated rollers no, and no straightening your hair. Yeah, no, exactly. Um, and we do encourage people to go to the hairdressers during treatment uh, and for exactly the same reasons that you said. Um, we do have the Paxman uh, a Guide to Scalp Cooling booklet um, and we do recommend that that is taken in to the salon so that they're aware that they're having scalp cooling and again that there's tips in there so that they, they understand what not to do. Just as you said there, please no big barrel um, blow dries or anything like that and it's just about being as gentle as possible but yeah. Go to the hairdressers, have the trim. The key message really is, yes, of course you can go to a hairdresser if that feels right for you, but just ask your hairdresser to be very gentle with the hair. Yeah, absolutely.